Welcome to the captivating world of The Pirate, a 1948 cinematic gem that has stood the test of time in the ever-evolving landscape of the film industry. What makes this movie a timeless symbol of cinematic prowess? Is there a cherished memory you hold dear associated with it? These are questions that echo the enduring qualities and personal connections that make The Pirate a classic. Before we delve into the random facts about this cinematic masterpiece, let's take a moment to reflect on what makes it a symbol of the industry's enduring legacy. Perhaps it's the magnetic performances, the immersive storytelling, or the unforgettable characters that etch themselves into our memories. As we explore the nuances of this film, consider what elements have made it resonate across generations. Now, imagine the allure of the screen drawing you into the vivid world of the pirate. Did you find yourself enraptured by the swashbuckling adventures or swept away by the magnetic chemistry of the characters? Whatever your cherished memory may be, we'd love to hear your stories and experiences in the comments below. As we journey through the cinematic landscape of the pirate, brace yourself for intriguing insights and random facts that add layers to this timeless creation. From the director's vision to behind-the-scenes anecdotes, each detail contributes to the rich tapestry that defines the cinematic treasure. What enduring qualities do you think make the pirate an everlasting symbol of the industry? What's your most cherished memory or personal experience related to this classic? Share your thoughts and stories in the comments below, and let's celebrate the magic of the pirate together. And now, without further ado, let's set sail into the world of the pirate, a cinematic journey that has left an indelible mark on the hearts of film enthusiasts around the world. The Pirate, a 1948 musical comedy film, directed by Vincent Minnelli, boasts a lively narrative set in the Caribbean. Starring Judy Garland and Gene Kelly, the plot revolves around Manuela, a young woman dreaming of romance, and Seraphin, a traveling performer mistaken for a notorious pirate. Fueled by mistaken identities and burgeoning love, the film weaves a captivating tale against a backdrop of vibrant musical numbers and dynamic choreography. Garland's emotive performance and Kelly's charismatic presence elevate the narrative, creating a memorable cinematic experience. The movie, though not an initial box office success, has since gained recognition for its innovative choreography, catchy songs, and the undeniable chemistry between its lead actors. Its impact on the musical genre is enduring, with elements of its style and narrative echoing through subsequent cinematic endeavors. The Pirate remains a testament to the golden era of Hollywood musicals, leaving an indelible mark on the cultural tapestry of its time. Originally conceived as a non-musical project, The Pirate underwent a series of casting changes before finding its rhythm. Initially intended for stars like Greer Garson and Walter Pidgeon, the film's journey to the screen involved a carousel of potential leads, including Cary Grant, Charles Lafton, Mia Malloy, Ingrid Bergman, and others. Eventually, the decision was made to pivot the project into a musical. The film's production, spanning from February 1947 to December 1947, faced challenges that contributed significantly to its financial struggles. The extended production period escalated costs, making it difficult for the movie to recoup its expenses at the box office. Despite the notable ensemble cast, the film's financial woes were exacerbated by a lukewarm reception from the audience. Adding an intriguing layer to the behind-the-scenes dynamics, Judy Garland, one of the film's leads, reportedly smoked four packs of cigarettes a day during filming. This detail sheds light on the personal habits of the actors and the working conditions during the production. While the pirate may not have initially struck gold at the box office, its journey from a non-musical concept with changing cast plans to a lively musical comedy reflects the unpredictability of Hollywood's creative process. The film's financial setbacks and Garland's smoking habits offer a glimpse into the challenges faced during its making, contributing to its unique narrative both on and off the screen. This snapshot of the pirate's production history adds depth to its legacy, showcasing the intricate web of decisions that shaped its final form and the hurdles it faced along the way. The film's eventual recognition for its innovative choreography and enduring impact on the musical genre attest to its lasting influence in the golden era of Hollywood. In the tumultuous production of The Pirate, Gene Kelly and Judy Garland passionately advocated for the inclusion of the Nicholas Brothers in the film's Be a Clown sequence. Their efforts, however, faced resistance, particularly in the South, 
where exhibitors cut the sequence due to the involvement of the black performers. This move reflected the racial prejudices of the time, with the Nicholas Brothers' contribution sidelined in certain U.S. cities. Beyond racial challenges, the movie stirred controversy with the song and dance number Voodoo, where Garland and Kelly portrayed a torrid romance. Louis B. Meyer, MGM chief, was so incensed by the intensity of their performance that he ordered the negative to be burned, highlighting the clashes between artistic expression and studio expectations. In the realm of dance rehearsals, an intriguing incident unfolded between Harold Nicholas and Gene Kelly. Accused of not knowing a routine, Nicholas proceeded to dance the entire sequence flawlessly, leaving Kelly speechless. This behind-the-scenes episode reflects the dedication and skill of the performers, adding an unexpected layer to the film's production dynamics. These incidents involving racial biases, artistic disagreements, and impressive displays of talent offer a glimpse into the challenges and complexities faced during the making of The Pirate. The struggles and triumphs behind the scenes contribute to the film's legacy, showcasing the intricate web of decisions and conflicts that shaped its final form. In the realm of Hollywood musicals, The Pirate stands out as the second collaboration between Judy Garland and Gene Kelly. The 1948 film, directed by Vincent Minnelli, not only showcases their on-screen chemistry but also delves into the intriguing dynamics behind the scenes. One remarkable aspect of The Pirate is its historical significance in film production. According to Judy Garland's biographer, Gerald Frank, the movie marked a unique milestone. It was the first instance where the studio took the unprecedented step of hiring a psychiatrist. This mental health professional was funded from the film's production budget, ensuring Garland's well-being during shooting and confirming her ability to perform. The challenges faced during the production extended beyond routine concerns. On the first day of filming the hypnosis scene in the town square, Garland's personal struggles came to the forefront. Disoriented from medications, she experienced a panic-inducing hallucination, believing she was on fire at the sight of lit torches on the set. This incident led her to inquire about substances like benzedrine or reefers from extras and crew members, ultimately requiring her to be taken home and put to bed, still in costume. These behind-the-scenes revelations provide a nuanced perspective on the making of the pirate, shedding light on the studio's innovative approach to mental health support and the personal challenges faced by the lead actress. The film's enduring legacy goes beyond its musical numbers and narrative, offering a glimpse into the complexities that shaped its final form and the resilience demonstrated by its cast and crew. As our cinematic voyage draws to a close, let's sail the seas of nostalgia and unravel the enigmatic tapestry of the pirate. Like a hidden treasure chest, this 1948 masterpiece invites you to delve into its beguiling world, filled with swashbuckling charisma and musical allure. As the curtains fall, I challenge you to reflect on the echoes of this timeless tale that resonate within your own narrative. Did the rhythm of Gene Kelly's dance steps awake in dormant dreams? Perhaps Judy Garland's mesmerizing vocals stirred a tempest of emotions, or the whimsical plot ignited a spark of whimsy in your heart. Now, it's your turn to unfurl the sails of memory. Share your musings, your cherished moments, or the whimsical notes that this cinematic symphony has played on the strings of your soul. Whether it's a quiet contemplation or a boisterous celebration, let your thoughts set sail, creating a communal mosaic of shared experiences. In this virtual amphitheater of reflections, your voice becomes the compass guiding others through the labyrinth of their own recollections. The pirate, with its timeless charm, becomes a vessel connecting us across time and space, weaving a collective tale that transcends the silver screen. Thank you for embarking on this cinematic odyssey with us. Your presence has been the wind in our sails, propelling us through the seas of shared nostalgia and discovery. Until our narratives intertwine again, may your memories of the pirate continue to dance in the moonlight of your consciousness. Farewell, fellow traveler, and thank you for entrusting your thoughts to this creative conversation. Your reflections are the jewels that adorn the treasure trove of shared experiences. Until next time, keep the spirit of the pirate alive in the seas of your memories.